Now it's my pleasure to welcome a fine public servant who represents the interests of Greater San Rafael with compassion and tenacity, President of the Marin County Board of Supervisors, Susan Adams. Thank you. And Lynn, I just wanted to thank you for continuing to be our moral compass in Congress on the issue of war. It's been 10 years since September 11th and about nine years since former President Bush announced mission accomplished. And nine years later, we still have war, now on three fronts at least, in the Middle East. It has a personal uh, impact on me and my family. My brother just came back from his seventh tour overseas and he is not the same man that he was uh, when he first started. It's time to bring our men and women home. With almost $2 billion being spent in Marin County of our taxpayer money, when we have homeless people, and some of my friends who are homeless are here in this crowd today, when we have women and children who are at risk of losing their health care, when we have seniors at risk for losing their services, when we're closing parks, when we're overcrowding our school classrooms, this is not the best way to stimulate our economy. And the best way to stimulate our economy is by stopping spending the money on this senseless war and bringing those dollars back home locally so we can solve the problems that we're dealing with in our local communities. And on the issue of terror, am I, two, another minute. You know, we have right here in our own homes terrorism. We have youth gangs shooting each other. We have the terror of people who are diagnosed with cancer who don't have health care. We have the terror of people that are losing their homes through foreclosure and not able to find a place to live and are bumped to our streets. And we need to fight the war on terror, this kind of terror, at home. So I'm just going to end by saying that, you know, it's time to bring our troops home, that as one of our um, famous songwriters of yore said, let's give peace a chance. Thank you.